Hold it, Wilmer. Hold it till I get this phone. Okay, Skizik. Wallet and Bobble Garage, Skizik's wallet speaking. Oh, what's that? Yes, sir, we can fix it. We can fix anything on four wheels. Sure, we'll be waiting for you right here in Gasoline Alley. <laughs> Yes, it's Gasoline Alley, the comic strip that's a favorite in more than a hundred great newspapers from coast to coast. In this episode, The Adventure of the Hypnotized Hero, the boys get mixed up in quite a mishmash of mesmerism. But right now, a word from the friendly Autolite dealer in your own hometown. Gasoline Alley. Just lately, there has been an epidemic of auto thefts in town, all attributed to hot car Harry. So this morning, Skeezix and his partner, Wilmer Bobble, are installing new locks on Professor Fulsom's car. At least, Skeezix is. As for Wilmer, well, Wilmer's mind seems concerned with something else entirely. Ah, there. The room was finished. Let's hand me that screwdriver, Wilmer. Ah. Oh, oh, sure. Here you are, Skeezix. Wilmer, that's a ball peen hammer, not a screwdriver. Ah. Oh, oh, sure. Screwdriver. Here. Yeah. Ah. I wonder why the mailman doesn't come. Will you stop worrying about the mail? I told you ten times Rufus is out front. He'll bring the mail when it comes. Yeah, if he doesn't go to sleep instead. What's the matter with him this morning? Hey, that's an idea. What's an idea? What are you talking about? When I get what the mailman's bringing me, I'll really put Rufus to sleep. That wouldn't be hard to do. Well, the locks are finished. Professor Folsom will just remember the locket. I'd like to see Hot Car Harry get away with this one. Here it is, Wilmer. That mail you've been in such a sweat about. Oh, boy, well, let's have it, Rufus. Okay. Home Institute of Hypnotic Art. Wow, Wilmer, so now you're going to be a hypotenimus. Uh, nipotinimus. So now you're a sucker for something else. And that here nose is there. There, Skeezix, what do you think of that? Take a look. Hypnotism in ten easy lessons. Now what, Wilmer? Sure, see, they, they show me lessons one and two. Now, you, just just let me have a look here. Uh, to, um, uh, to put your subject in a trance, look them straight in the eyes and say, You are in my power. Then you say, You will now sleep. You are very sleepy. Oh, I sure am, Wilmer. Rufus, I wasn't even looking at you. I know, but I'm sleepy just the same. My gosh, that's it. I'll hypnotize Rufus. Oh, no, Wilmer. No, you don't. Uh, before you go into your act, Wilmer, how about seeing what that customer wants? Okay, Skeezy, but stay right where you are, Rufus. Lesson two. Fix the subject with a steady, cold reptilian... Yeah. Sometimes I think Wilmer is almost as dumb as I am. Hey, ski six. Why don't I let Wilmer hypnotize me, huh? Oh, Wilmer doesn't know that much about it, Rufus. I know, but just to make him happy, I could pretend. Oh, wait, that. wait, wait. Here he comes. There was just a guy putting some free air in his tires. Okay, Rufus, you're ready to be hypnotized. I've got it all studied out. Sure, Wilmer, I'm ready. I'm really ready. Huh, Uh, Rufus, I don't believe I... I know attention to Skeezix, Rufus. I'll just prove to him I can do it. Oh, I'm sure you can do it, Wilma. In fact, I can guarantee it. I mean... Uh, now, where's my book? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we are. Eh, uh, And uh, now, look me right in the eyes, Rufus. Keep looking. Keep looking. There. Eh, uh, Rufus, you are now in my power... Yes, Master, I am in your power. Yeah, he is. Holy smokes! 
Geez, it's even I didn't think it would work out fair. Oh, now, look, Wilma. Rufus isn't really hypnotizing. But certainly... he isn't hypnotized. I've got eyes, haven't I? You are very sleepy, very sleepy, aren't you, Rufus? Yes, master. Look at that, Skeezix. He's so sound asleep he snored. Yes, Wilmer, but I've been trying to tell well, let you me, that... Let me, let me see what else I can make him do. And listen, Rufus, you are now a little woolly lamb, see? A lamb. Yes, master. Meh. Meh. Oh, all right, fellas. That's enough horseplay. A customer just drove in with a flat tire. Come on, Wilmer. Okay, Skeezix. Okay, Rufus. Snap out of it. You are now out of my power. Wilmer, look. It's Mayor Ransom's car. Yeah, I recognized it, too. Well, how are you today, Your Honor? What was that you just called me, Bubba? That's not Mayor Ransom, Skeezix. Boy, what a tough guy. I, uh... I saw you in Mayor Ransom's car, so I thought you were Mayor Ransom. Well, I ain't Mayor Ransom, and it's ain't Mayor Ransom's car. Oh, yes, it is Mayor Ransom's car, mister. We work on it plenty of time, okay, but we Okay, I want you to work on it again, right now. Get busy and fix his flat tire. Oh, then, of course, the mayor wants us to put on the new set of four super balloons he talked to us about. Look, Bub, I just want his flat fixed and fast, see? But the mayor asked us to order him, and we've got him. He told us to put him on first time he had a flat. Well, he changed his mind. Changed his mind. I think I'd better call and him. And I think if you what? take one more step, Bub, I'll have to use this on you. Holy smoke, a gun. All, All right, right, stupid. And I know how to use it, too. Excuse me. Th- 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 this guy must be... He must okay, be... Okay, stupid, if you insist on a formal intro, the name is Harry. Hot car Harry. A car thief? Right. The cops are looking for me, so I'm in a slight hurry. Now then, do you guys fix this flat? Or do I start shooting? Gasoline Alley and the Adventure of the Hypnotized Hero. Right now, Skeezix, Wilmer, and Rufus are changing a tire on Mayor Ransom's car, which has been stolen by the notorious auto thief, Hot Car Harry. And at the moment, Hot Car Harry himself is standing over the boys with a gun. All right, you yokels, get a move on with that tire. We're working fast as we can, Mr. Hot. Mr. Carr, I mean, Mr. Harry. We, we, we work faster if you, if you point that pan in the other way. Stop shaking, Wilmer, and hand me that tire tool. Well, I'm, I'm not shaking because I'm scared. See, it's just, 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 just sort of cool in here. You'd all better be scared. You better hurry, too. You there. You mean me, Mr. Hot Harry? I mean... Yeah, you. Snap it up. Stop stumbling around like you're asleep in your feet. Oh, uh, Rufus can't help it. He always looks like that. I wish I were asleep somewhere far, far away from here. Sleep. Skeezix, that gives me a great idea. What do you mean, Wilmer? Sleep. By using my hypnotism, I'll put Hot Car Harry to sleep. Wilmer, you're crazy. You're... I hypnotized Rufus, didn't I? What did I try to tell you about that? Rufus all right, was... you two. What's all that mumbling about down there? Well, here I go, Skeezix. Hey, you. What are you standing up for? <laughs> Wilma, please, Rufus. Shut up, you. Okay, stupid. Now, what are you up to? Uh, yeah, Bob. I want to look you right in the eyes, Mr. Hot Car Harry. Well, well, at a time like this, stupid feels romantic. Look, dope, you are now in my power, Mr. Hot Car Harry. What? What are you talking about? You are now getting very sleepy. You are now getting slightly nuts. I slept nine hours last night. You are now getting very, very sleepy. Look, bird brain, I don't know what you're up to, but you better stop right where you are. Wilmer, Wilmer, he's pointing the gun at you. Yeah, you got some sense, bub. You better stop him before you I... You are now getting very, very, very sleepy. <sighs> Stop staring at me like that, will you? Listen, you other guys, is this character nuts? He thinks he's a hypnotist, but he's he gone completely off his rocker. 
Now listen, you, I don't like to shoot a crazy guy. Yo, why now? A little woolly lamb. Hey, hey, do something this crazy much taller on me. Watch out, you get him off of me. I'll help you hold him up, Mr. Harry, and I'll also give you this. Skeezix. Skeezix! You knocked him out. Yeah, and Wilmer's out, too. Don't stand there, Rufus. Tie up Mr. Hot Car Harry with that piece of wire. Oh, okay. There you are. Good. Wilmer. Wilmer, wake up. Wilmer! Ah, where where, where, where am I? Wilmer, you hypnotized yourself. You fell on your face. Yeah, now Mr. Hot Car's out on his back. He's out on his... Holy smoke, Skeezix, it worked. I hypnotized him. You didn't hypnotize anybody but yourself, Walmart. Oh, why then, huh? Well, what's he doing there on the floor? Skeezix hit him on the jaw and knocked him there. You might have been killed, Wilmer. I try to tell you that you haven't got any hypnotic power. But I have. I hypnotized Rufus. Go on. Tell him, Rufus. That was just a joke, Walmer. I wasn't hypnotized. I was just pretending. You, 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 you mean I... I walked into this guy's gun thinking I could... Oh! Oh, no! Oh, yes. Oh. Hey, look, Skeezix. Wilma's hypnotized himself again. <laughs> Your Gasoline Alley friends will be back in just a moment. Now, a word from your own Autolite dealer. Now, a word about the next adventure in Gasoline Alley. Here's Skeezix. Well, now that we're on our own for the evening, Wilmer, let's go to the restaurant for dinner. A restaurant, Skeezix? Didn't you ever hear of the J. Wilmer Bobble method of broiling a steak? Frankly, no. How do you do it? He puts a steak under the fire in the oven, Skeezix, and then he puts a big pot of water on the stove. Yes, Rufus, and then? The water boils over just as the steak catches on fire, and that keeps the house from burning down. (laughs) 